we're in the home stretch of Art Prize, a festival that was supposed to take place last year before being canceled due to the pandemic, a pandemic that has taken its toll on healthcare workers across the state. 13 on your side's Veronica Ortega is live in Grand Rapids with how one nurse turned that hardship into inspiration. Good morning, Veronica. Good morning, Meredith. Miranda Kearns Garcia is a wife, a mother, and an ICU nurse. She created this piece entitled A Face of the Front Line. It's a tribute to healthcare workers that continue to battle COVID 19 during this ongoing pandemic. The display is made up of medicine caps from actual patients at Memorial Healthcare Center in Owasso, most of them from COVID patients. There are more than 1,000 caps, each from a different medication. Garcia says she was inspired to create this display because of the beautiful colors and seeing what her coworkers do every day. The picture is of a tired, exhausted healthcare worker. <laughs> um, you know, some people think that it's me you know, as a nurse, but in reality, it could be any of us. Garcia says she's always enjoyed art and has dabbled in painting and photography, but this is her first entry into Art Prize. She first shared the display on Facebook and was encouraged by her coworkers to submit it into the competition. Garcia encourages everyone to wear a mask, reminding people that healthcare workers are doing their best and anything we can do to get out of this pandemic would help. In the last year and a half, I've pretty much been an ICU COVID nurse. And, you know, we kind of have like peaks and valleys, you know, like it'll spike and then it'll get a little better and then it'll spike. We're kind of in one of those spikes right now, unfortunately. Now it took about a year and a half to collect all of the medicine caps and about one week to complete the display. Garcia says working on this piece gave her a sense of release and relief and it was honor to work on it. Back to you guys.